You may have noticed a lot of unique cars on the road this week. Most are here for the fall edition of the Emerald Coast Cruise and Car Show, which started today. As News 13's Alex Sly tells us, several thousand vehicles are registered to participate in the event. Aaron Beston Park has turned into a parking lot full of old, new, and restored automobiles. People from all over the country are in Panama City Beach to show off and have fun with their hot rod. Men, women, children, and all here. We even got three couples from Australia. Officials say 3,000 cars will be there this weekend. Besides cars, fans can eat, drink, shop for car accessories, apparel, and memorabilia, and enjoy live music. We've got a big band that's going to play uh, Loud Planet that'll be out here. You can sit out in your cars and watch that. But tomorrow during the day, we've got a band playing, and on Saturday, we've got a band playing. Event organizers will also be honoring veterans. We're doing little thing Friday, but we're, our big one was on Saturday. We, we uh, support our veterans up there, and then before the concert, we're doing a big salute with all the veterans and stuff and having veterans up on stage. Everett Cole is among the veterans who will be honored. Since leaving the Army, Cole spends his free time refurbishing military vehicles. He brought his favorite to the show this year. This particular Jeep, I found it in Spokane, Washington, cut in half in the back of a construction yard. I bought it drug it home, welded it back together, and started the process of restoration. And it's been with me for the last 20 years. Cole says he drove the same model Jeep while serving in Vietnam. Which is probably why I have such an affinity for it. In Panama City Beach, Alex Lai, News 13, Panhandle Strong. Emerald Coast Cruising runs through Saturday night. You can buy single-day tickets or a three-day pass.